What is going on guys, it is L321 here today, and today guys, I am going to attempt to get Fortnite USB mods on the Xbox One. If you guys want to see more of these videos, let me know, give the video a like rating, and without further ado, let's get straight into this video. For the best Xbox and PlayStation mods, such as modded accounts, mod menus, modded Xboxes, and more, check out L321mods.com. Yeah. So it has come to my attention that there is many videos out there on YouTube right now showing people how to get Fortnite USB mods on your Xbox One console. So what I'm going to be doing today is, is I'm going to go onto YouTube and I'm going to try and follow some of these videos online and see whether they are legit or not. Okay, so I've got my USB ready. I'm gonna go onto YouTube right now and let's see what we can do. And uh, I can see a few videos already on here. So let's start off with this video right here. This video has 16,000 views. It was only uploaded one week ago, so it's pretty new. And yeah, let's go ahead and watch this video. So for copyright reasons, I'm not going to show you guys the video, but what I'm going to do is put the headphones on and I'm going to watch the video and I'm going to try and attempt to recreate what is happening in the video and hopefully get some Fortnite Battle Royale USB mods. So I'll see you guys in just a moment. Okay, so what I've got from this video is absolute AIDS, to be honest with you. Um, the video basically says what I have to do is download the file and I have to rename the file whatever console I'm using. So if I'm using an Xbox One, what I have to do is, is rename the file 2018menus.xbox1. Jesus Christ, but apparently that's how you do it. But the thing is, the tutorial is only about three minutes, so the guy has dragged the video out so he can make more money on the video. So it's not the end of the world, but this video doesn't look too legit so far. So let's go ahead and try and download this mod menu. So here we go, download section, um, USB mod menu, uh, USB anti-band. So I can actually get a USB mod which has an anti-band on it apparently. So let's go ahead and try and download it. So I'm not exactly surprised he's left a link which he makes money off, which is a absolute ad infested piece of shit link. And I cannot download this without turning my ad block off. So let's go ahead and turn it off. Hopefully I can get rid of these disgustingly shit ads in a second. And get rid of this old motherfucker on here. So there we go. Skip ad. Let's skip the shitty ad. And there we go, guys. This is the file right here. Anti-ban. Your file is ready. Let's go ahead and download this. This should be very interesting. Oh, for Christ's sake. Yeah, of course there's a survey. So not only have you got to click on an ad-infested piece of AIDS link, you now have to try and get past this, which is a goddamn survey. You have your download in no time. Just complete any of the offers below, okay? So I'm going to go ahead and enter this one here. I would love a cup of tea for a year, have unlimited supply for a year, that's great. Let me let me enter it, please. Okay, so I'm clicking it and nothing's happening. All right, let's try and click this one. Nothing's happening. Enter, win iPhone 8, nothing happens. Easy jet, nothing happens. And whatever this is, nothing happens. So I'm trying to click the links, nothing's happening, guys. This doesn't look good. This video is faker than your nan's fake teeth. I'm gonna go ahead and dislike this video and we're gonna move on to the next one. Also, a side note, this one YouTuber here has like seven different videos on this subject. And I'm assuming every single video has got a fake download link. So let's go ahead and check this one right here. This is on the top of the search engine right here. Let's see if this video is legit. I will get back to you guys in a moment once I've watched it. This guy has pretty much given me one of the most AIDS explanations I've ever seen to how this works. All right, guys, just sit back, get a can of baked beans, open them up, start eating them and shoving them down your fat long throat and listen to this. So this guy is pretty much saying that what you need to do is download a USB mod, put it on a USB, place it into your Xbox, and he says that you need to plug it in and you need to run the Fortnite game on the USB. So apparently has the entire game on the USB. Oh, my God. This is horrendous. 
if people actually fall for this, they must be dumber than a donkey's dick because this is ridiculous. And also something I found quite funny was the fact that he has something in the description saying PC USB mod menu. I, I don't know about you guys, but I've never heard of a PC USB mod menu before. I thought that was quite hilarious. If you mod a game on PC, you simply put it in the game files on the hard drive. You don't have a USB plugged into your PC. Oh, that's just so dumb. But anyways, guys, I'm going to try and download this. So we've got another ad link as expected anyway. But let's just see if there's actually a legit download on this one. Alright, so after quite a while of messing around on the stupid survey website, I was able to get hold of a download to a Fortnite USB mod file. This is pretty hilarious, guys. I have no idea whether these guys who make these videos actually want people to download the file, because if they do, then they will know it's fake. But anyways, I managed to track one down, and I have it on my computer right now. So guys, here is the file. I put it in a folder called fake and this is the file right here it is named usbmods.xbox so it's a xbox file so what i think gives it away the most is the size really i mean um they could have put a bit more effort into that but anyways the size pretty much gives it away from the get-go so guys don't watch their videos don't even give them the click because it's absolute aids they don't deserve the views on the videos so guys that is about it for this video i hope you guys did enjoy make sure to subscribe to my channel if you are new for the best modding trolling and gaming content and i will see you guys next time